I've seen a lot of people talk about it. And so I figured we would just cover it here anyway. Tell you guys what I'm doing. Everyone's going to have their own special. I do it this way. I'm, I'm playing this solo. I get it. I get it. There's, there's, there's lots of good solos and ways to do it. This is the way I did it on my main account. This is the way I'm going to be doing it on my no money spend account. How we get this cam chancellor, how we getting them. Let's go find out. If you're looking to build the best team in Madden, make sure you head over to MMOEXP.com to avoid the packs and save some racks. Use code CC for 5% off. Link is in the description below. Fastest coins, cheapest coins. Use code CC. We'll see you guys on the sticks. 5% off. Be great. Here comes the money. Here we go. Money talks. Here comes the money. Smoking in the mirror at your practice in my wrist flick. I can't settle for a quarter. Real fast. Need a bare maximum. Word to Khalil Mack. Hey, what is going on, man? Family? I know I'm late to the party here. I don't care if I'm late. We're here, okay? Now, again, this is going to go for almost any of these potential objectives that come down the line, too, that are about wins, fumbles, sacks, all this sort of stuff. We're going to be able to use this. So just hit the like if this helps you out. Make sure you are subscribed. Again, we're not asking much. It is a no money spend video. So let's go. So the Cam Chancellor objective sound. Obviously, the win 120 career solo battle head-to-head -head season games was a career thing. So if you already had it, it's there. If you don't, you got to go win those games. It's everything else. And we see on this account, I have played zero games so far. But we do have Cam done on the other account, okay? Now, again, this isn't sacks with Cam Chancellor. Again, the wording is terrible on these. Get 200 sacks with Cam Chancellor. Cam Chancellor doesn't have to have the sack, right? Cam has to be on your team. So first off, put Cam on your team. Step one. Now the sacks and takeaways and wins, we're going to combine those all into one thing in here. Now for the wins, 250 wins is a lot. What I would recommend you do is first off, go through and you can do this first or last. It's up to you. Finish off some of these outstanding solos. Like for me, I haven't done any of this gridiron forge. You could go do all that or do the ultimate legend solos. You're going to rack up some stats there anyway, right? And these are things that you probably want to be doing. So go ahead. But if you really, really want cam and you're like, I got to get cam up to 99. You only need three more of the collectibles to get them to 99. You know, the, the last one is the win 250 games is going to take a little bit longer. Uh, some people have been doing. Oh, I go into campaign and I play week 16. What am I going to do? I can't play it in week, week 16. I can't play that, right? There's a John Lynch solo in week three that people have mentioned. This one. Uh, again, the problem with this one is the game is just tied and they run the ball. And I'll tell you what I don't like when I'm trying to get sacks is them running the ball. So we go into the Black History Month solo here. Koidi Pay here or home is where you make it. And I played on one star, so it's on Rookie Arcade. What is good about this is really simple. A, they're losing. B, clock is against them. So they're not going to run the ball. Uh, I will go here. Uh, I will go and I will set my tackling to aggressive. And I will just run mid blitz. Again, pretty standard. You press, you pass commit, you get on this guy and you bring him down into the gap. They will pass the ball each and every time here. They will all, they will always pass the ball. There's no, oh, they're going to run. Don't worry about that. You complete it. You go back to replay, go over to recent plays, do it again. Bam, bam, bam. Over and over and over and over and over. Now they're not going to fumble every time. And that is perfectly fine because there's going to be certain plays times you get multiple sacks, right? No fumble there. Sometimes he will throw the ball, throw it away, whatever it is. Uh, if they hurry up, make sure you reset your play as well see there like we didn't get to him quite in time again that's fine sometimes the computer throws the ball away but we are at least avoiding them running the ball on us with lots and lots of wasted downs here okay that's that's the whole goal that is the whole goal find solos but they don't do that you don't have to go into punt safe and audible and hope that we don't have to do that now, if you're on current gen or old gen xbox series x or whatever it is or ps4 uh and then at that point uh you can probably just use a rush them as 335 wide similar concept to what we did last year 
click on this one. No takeaways, but we got two fumbles and we're going to get the win or we got two sacks in the win. So this, this is how we build this up pretty, pretty quickly. And again, go to replay well, again, recent plays, bam, make it work. This way is really simple and there are no wasted downs because of running. Maybe wasted downs because they throw the ball away or he tries to pass it. And that's kind of every solo. But again, if they hurry up, make sure you reset the play because they're going <laughs> to... The man ups get misaligned and like, don't try to score. There's no point to score here either. Just go down, replay, bam, bam, bam. So again, we're getting a lot of this stuff done at the same time and very efficiently. I might add, I haven't seen anyone running this solo again. What do people normally do? They just do exactly what the first person says to tell them to do. Whereas I decided, I was like, let me go look like there's gotta be better solos. There's gotta be better ways. I'm not playing up to the campaign to get this done. I'm not playing. That's a waste of my time. These solos you should probably already have or be close to having them already again. Bam, bam, bam. We go down. Okay. So again, if you want to do these first and then play the extra solos you have left over or the extra solos first, and then this again, totally up to you. Uh, maybe it's a time thing. Oh, I'm trying to finish gridiron forge before the new one comes out. We'll go play those first, obviously. Right. Uh, everything else doesn't really have a time crunch. The bad thing you're not going to get really XP for this. Unfortunately, kind of hate it. Uh, but like even here, I've got the gridiron solos left. I've got gridiron forge left ultimate legends. Uh, I think I'm not doing the super bowl present ones. They were pretty terrible. So I'll go finish those and then I'll come back to the cam grind for myself. So we didn't play for very long here at all. Um, and we did a lot of talking and maybe not focused locked in, but that's okay. You know, again, we got four wins, five sacks, three turnovers. Pretty quickly pretty quickly you should be able to get four of these done the win 250 is, is a bit longer but if you just grinded this out it's gonna take you probably about two hours give or take give or take two hours to get 99 cam it's up to you right a good way to do it if you want to sit and no life it feel free if you don't then don't okay i don't care I really, 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 really do not care. Uh, but while you were doing it too, make sure that you get like at least some of your daily objectives done. Make sure you open your pack with the get a player. Make sure you do your set to get a player packs. I still feel like they are profitable in the long run. I've pulled platinums out of here recently too. Uh, when I do my one pack, I have to buy every day. It's always a get a player pack on this account. I will not open anything else intentionally. And if we don't have like the, oh, the set's not complete. I'll go open two, three, whatever it takes. Because if we hit something like an elite card right here, uh, an 84, that's at least profit. It ain't a lot of profit where you could take the training, I guess, but here, we'll just take the coins, right? Again, minimal. Maybe you save it. Maybe there's a better thing to do with it. I don't really know. Uh, but this is the way I've been doing things pretty basic again i know i'm behind on this account i get that i'm behind i didn't spend any time on the weekend on this account that's why before i, I already see you guys just typing like, oh you, you're you're not even done nope don't care to have been done it's fine let's fit i want to get the set done here just in case i forget later on because this is going to give us uh some of these objectives done at least which means a little bit of x and we do need to get rolling on the XP here. Uh, again, if you happen to be trying to do diamond sets, make sure you put the high golds and any elites into the diamond sets. Uh, at the same point, we get one exchange done. And if you pull a card that sells, power ups do sometimes randomly sell. Uh, you can check Jordan Phillips. He don't sell for anything really. We'll just take the training. But we at least finish the get a set we finished the get a pack really easy we did profit through it we get the xp boost right here bam bam and we get our level five pack finally season champion pack so 
that is how I am getting Cam Chancellor done. We'll call it the fastest way. Maybe there's a faster way. If you have a 100, like 60, this was definitely better. Put it in the comment section. Sure. Love you guys. I'm out. Peace.